What's up guys? This is the Finesse Father and we have a game here for you on Sand River Sandstorm in a Troll 100. Also guys, big shout out goes out to Destroyer 606. Now guys, as you can see here, we have a standard battle. The greens have taken the eastern spawn and the reds have taken the northwestern. Now, Sandstorm is a medium light tanker's dream. You can get close, you can fire, you don't really have to worry too much about being detected. It is just amazing. <clears throat> and the best part is, they have the spotting ability to just go out there and make it happen. So, big kudos for us. We're going to see some big numbers, possibly, uh, with this uh, sandstorm here. So, moving on, as you can see here, we're running on the left, and you guys have seen me run the left before. It's kind of one of my favorite things to do, uh, because normally you can spot a lot of these guys, and, you know, if you can get them as they're moving into position, a lot of them silhouette themselves on top of the hill, which is just money, money, money for the guy sitting behind. Uh, but as you can see here, guys, our background is a little weak. We don't have anybody behind us. But you know what? That's not going to stop the Troll 100. We're going to go ahead and get up here full throttle and light some guys up. Hopefully, some of this team of artillery will start shooting at them because we have a plethora of artillery on our side of the uh, team here. Now, as you can see here, guys, there's a lot of reds in this position. You don't really see that a whole, whole lot anymore. Normally, your main point of contention is going to be uh, the northern area, uh, right around B5, B6. And nowadays, now granted, of course, back in the day, we're talking two, three years ago, this area over here used to be the hot spot. Now, moving on, enough about the uh, reminiscing here. Moving on, <laughs> we have got some excellent shots right here. We're trying to stay moving because, you know, we're still detected. So we're very, very aware of that. Uh, and at this time, we're unknown, or you know, as to what this gentleman's background is. So, and what I mean by that is, you know, who's behind him? What's going on behind him? Is there a TD on Overwatch? You know, you have to think of these things as a medium tanker, as a light tanker, as any tanker. If you're going to get in here and, and mix it up and just kind of really chop it up with somebody. So just be aware of that. Now, as you can see here, if he did have any help, they are definitely watching him get killed. <laughs> so I don't, I think we're pretty safe there. Uh, put a round in that gentleman right there. A top-notch work. Uh, he is, he's in trouble, but at this point, he was in too deep. Not a whole lot you can do about it. So we're, we're kind of trying to stack bodies like cordwood down in here, but we have to be careful because you know what? They have a lot of artillery still left, and I am not fan of, a fan of it at all. Uh, we're going to try to get some shots here uh, if this gentleman will get the front end of his tank out of the way. Put a round on the side of that gentleman right there. Uh, by this gentleman, I mean my compadre. I <laughs> didn't notice that was his tank. Uh, put some good rounds on this gentleman right here. It's it's not really happening just because of his angle, I think. Uh, I, I was just about to say I felt like he was looking at me. Sure enough, we get around punched into us. And it looks like he's using that, that wreckage of that tank as cover. So bully for him. There's not really a whole, whole lot we can do at this point because he's got a little bit of action going on over there. We can't necessarily come out and roll him or else we'd, we'd be putting ourselves in a dicey situation at best. Trying to kind of see here if I can't search for any shots. He moves out and just opens up a perfect shot for me. Now, we do have a good piece of cover right here, but we have to be kind of cautious because we are beset on all sides by enemies. So, we have to be, uh, you know, vigilant, I guess is what I would say, because they're trying to come down this little trench here in the middle. And that kind of seems like, recently, that is the thing to do. I don't know where that came from. It used to be nobody would ever take that, but now it's a big deal. Anyway, moving on, uh, we're kind of, we. speaking of in too deep, we are in too deep now. We kind of have guys, a couple of guys down here in the trench. We're trying to kind of finesse them. Uh, it's not necessarily working out. Uh, it seems like the reload on this T-100 is taking forever. Uh, I've got multiple targets. I'm getting the fudge out of here. I'm not about that getting shot life. And on the way out, I go ahead and put a round on that gentleman. Uh, we have somebody else coming in here, see if we can't pull off a nice auto-lock shot. Uh, put one right into him. 
and maybe see if we can help out my man here. Uh, we get that tank off of him, and now we're going to go ahead and move in and try to help uh, my man right here end up finishing off this gentleman. And then, boom, there we go. The Death Star just said, you know what? I've seen what you're doing down here. I don't approve of it. I've had enough of it. You need to get the fudge out of here. And then he just pretty much ends me. But, yeah, that's... And it felt like, to me, this game was very, very hectic. This game was a big rampage. And I'm okay with that. I'm very, very okay with that. It, it just felt very... didn't feel organized at all. And for a while, I thought the clickers had killed me, not the tank destroyer. But, yeah, it's okay. It's fine. We did okay. Got lots of kills, lots of damage. Just a tiny, tiny bit of assist. And now, Baron Sogo is making a run on this gentleman right here trying to get him off the board if he can uh, he, he's trying to outrun the gun and it looks like I looked at the map at just the wrong time uh, to kind of see the action <laughs> and he ended up taking him out but either way uh, you know that was that was good there uh, got a good congratulations there from someone I cannot for the life of me remember what team he was on maybe you can comment below and tell me uh, but as you can see here guys uh, you know we're on our way out here as a team not a whole whole lot we can do but you know what guys sometimes you have to just go out there and give it your best even if you don't win so just you know keep that in mind there's sometimes there's nothing you can do uh, ex except go out there and and you know kill as many people as you can and get as much damage as you can and then cash out uh, but we did we did have a good game 4035 94 assist guys hope you enjoy Please remember to subscribe. We'll see you next time.